Hmm. That doesn't look quite right. There we go. That's a little better. Uh, hey, everybody. Welcome back to another Diecast review. This is John Andretti's 2004 number one DEI uh, snap-on Chevy Monte Carlo, I guess is the only way to put it, but this car is sharp. Uh, we'll go ahead and take a look at the box, and then we'll get on to the amazing looking die cast. So, uh, here on the side, you see we got DEI, John Andretti, uh, the late John Andretti, may he rest in peace. Um, there's a picture of the one car there, uh, and another one there. If you go over to this side here, you can see we got one of 3,468, and um, that'll pretty much wrap up all that there is to see on the box. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the die cast here. So on the die cast here, you can see down the left side, we've got just the little uh, DEI E here. Uh, the number one leaning forward as always. We got Snap on uh, Napa. Uh, we got the number one on the roof leaning forward as well. Uh, DEI is the hood sponsor, which is kind of cool, uh, or Dale Earnhardt. Um, and then we're going to get into the most obvious part. Look at this red. This is a really, really nice looking red. Um, you just get to look at that. It's it, This is a fantastic color. Snap-on on the rear deck lid and on the rear end. We've got Dale, Dale Earnhardt Inc.com. You can see the, the fuel cell in the back there. But overall, this car, the, the main thing about this car isn't the paint scheme or anything like that. It's the paint itself. This red color looks amazing. And you can see it all the way around this car. This red is um, is just top-notch. It's like a... It's a Reminds me of the 2005 Earnhardt Daytona car where the red is just fantastic. Um, it's not bland. It's just if the whole car was just one solid color of this red, I would still look good with no numbers or anything. Um, but it looks fantastic. This red is is really jaw-dropping. I love this color. This is a very cool color. I, I want to get one of these in this red color with an Elite. Um, but, man, this color is very cool. So... Man, I love it. Let's go ahead and take a look under the hood while we're there uh, because I'm getting distracted by just the color. It's mesmerizing. Uh, there you see the air uh, filter there. we got the valve covers as well, a couple of hoses that go to the radiator. But otherwise, it's pretty simple. 2004 engine detail. There wasn't a super crazy amount of stuff, but still more than we see now. Underneath, there's our rear end detail back here and our front end detail over here. Also, the tires do have stickers on them, so that's kind of cool. Um, but other than that, that'll pretty much, uh, that's pretty much all there is on these, uh, on the undercarriage there. We do have the rubber window net. They went to cloth in 2006, and then, man, that red. I could just stare at that red all day. I mean, this red is fantastic. Goes. This would go great with the 2005 Dale Jr. car from the Daytona 500. I mean, this red is... As I said, it's mesmerizing. This is a very, very nice looking red. I, I can't even describe it in a video. I mean, you guys can see it, but until you get to see it in the right light, it's the, the camera can only capture so much. But man, is it good. Um, wow. Anyway, uh, that'll pretty much wrap up this review. Let me know your thoughts on the uh, John Andretti car here. Uh, it's definitely a cool car that he ran for him just a handful of times, but man, that color is just awesome. Uh, but yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Turn on the notification bell so you don't miss an upload. Subscribe if you're new for all the daily diecast uh, uploads I do. Um, and if you're interested in this car, it is on the eBay page, which will be linked in the description below. But uh, other than that, I hope you've enjoyed. This has been Race Craze, and we'll see you in the next diecast review.